I have a short one today, uh, but kind of interesting. Uh, Jenny writes, Hey, Amy, I hope you're doing well. I have a cat question for you. My friend and neighbor got a new neighbor and they are now smelling marijuana come through the vents from there. Their cat has now pooped on the table and peed on the couch. Would that be due to the smell or is something else going on? She's about three years old and I don't know what's happening. Well, Jenny, thanks for your question. Um, actually, any change can really set off a cat and they act out using their elimination because making things smell like them calms them down. I know that's kind of a nasty thought for us, but cats will use urine to baptize an area that is uh, uncomfortable or, or stressful for them and that self scent helps reduce their stress and calms them down so yes if the smell of marijuana is uh, upsetting to them that's something that absolutely could be an issue um, I will also offer a caution I know that there uh, are places now where marijuana is legal for humans uh, it is very dangerous for our pet cats and dogs. In fact, the veterinary emergency rooms are now seeing overdoses in their pets uh, because uh, oftentimes people, you know, it's helping them and they think, oh, well, okay, it's helping me. Maybe this will help my pet as well. The problem is the operative ingredient in marijuana for humans can be toxic to pets. Now the CBD oil, there are some supplements that are designed specifically for our pets. Now that's something you can ask your veterinarian about and those, if they are designed for pets, those may be safe. And in fact, that could be something could help calm these, uh, these cats down or this kitty cat down if uh, the cat is urinating and defecating on owner objects. Usually they're going to target things that smell like the owner because it smells comforting to them as well. So it's kind of a backhanded compliment in a way. I do -do 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 -do.